I'm Will Nesbitt. My game is Realm of Loggers. It's a game of Arthurian legend. King Arthur rules in a peaceful and bountiful land called Loggers, where he searches for Excalibur. But little does he know, there is trouble afoot in his lands. Our game promises high drama and low complexity. Easy to learn, fun to play, interesting and ever-changing player choices. Will Merlin be there in your time of need? Will Lancelot betray his king? The picks are at the gate. Beasts and things yet worse await. Who will prevail? Will at last the usurper meet his doom? But this is a game as much about telling a tale as it is about winning or losing. And every good tale is about characters. At the beginning of the game you'll be dealt two characters. If you're playing the loyal side, you'll be dealt two good characters, like King Arthur or Sir Galahad. But if you're playing the usurpers, you'll get two evil characters, like Prince Mordred and Morgan Le Fay. Some characters are very powerful, others are not, but they all have an important role to play in telling the tale of King Arthur. Actions are resolved by rolling Arthur dice. The main area of play is an abstracted map of mythical England with locations like Stonehenge and Camelot. Stonehenge and Camelot are features, and when a character enters a feature like the Dark Tower or the Nunnery, then that character's token is placed on the feature card. In addition, characters may leave the board in order to go on quests. There are many quests, but the most important quests are the Grail Quest and the Quest for Excalibur. Movement across these many locations is tracked by tokens. There's a token for King Arthur, there's a token for each of his allies, and of course there are tokens for his enemies as well. You'll start the game with a pair of characters, but events and actions may force you to draw a different pair of characters. Every character is a tool that can help you win the game, but every character is also an important element in retelling the tale of Arthur. Because of the almost limitless permutations of characters and locations, this game plays different every single time, but every single time it feels like you're living an adventure. We've had a lot of fun developing this game. We've had a lot of fun playing this game. If you like Tales of Arthur, if you like games of adventure, you'll love this game. Arthur needs your support, and we need your support. If you put your trust in us, we won't let you down. In addition to your financial support, we need you to put the word out for us. Let others know about this great game so that we can share it with the world. Oh, <sighs>